Um, but she took a bunch of, my Google photos made me think of it, she took a bunch of pictures of the uh, pickups we were doing for the film set this past weekend. Oh, there's wizards here. There are wizards here. Uh, and Hamster was like, I need a new profile picture. Like, you got to take one with me in the camera. Uh, and <laughs> after after the weekend was done, Beard and McTrader Face was like, I took so many! But they're all just very awkward moments that Beard and Trader Face selected to uh, capture. <laughs> Took a couple of me while I was asleep. Yeah. Which was cool. What? Cool? Yeah. <laughs> I was scrolling through the pictures and I was like, oh, that's you. <laughs> Terrific. Also, I was on set that entire day. I don't, I think there's like two pictures of me. Like, even in group shots. <laughs> The, to be fair, there's some really funny ones involving you, though, where Hamster and Maggie were, like, laying on the roof of the car, and you that were standing true. there. That is true. But even then, I requested she take that photo. That wasn't oh. even her, like, capturing a funny moment. That was that was set up. Really living up to her name. <laughs> no, not him! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Perfect throw, Link. It, it worked. That's all that matters. I'm glad there's more bombs in this place, so I don't have to keep waiting for them to regrow. And that didn't even matter, because I got them right away. Nice shot, Link. Just behind yep. the camera. Well. Stone cold. <laughs> This is where I died last time. Yes, I thought it had something to do with the dark nuts. Luckily I have two fairies, right? That'll help <laughs> me, surely. I mean, objectively they will. That's distraction. <laughs> Did he hit the other one? Yeah. The fool. <laughs> the drunken <laughs> fool. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's been too long since we <laughs> mentioned how old. We both went for the kill at the same time. <laughs> but I emerged victorious. Which anime opening is that? <laughs> it's actually not an anime. It's from one of the Ooh. Berserk video games. So it's an anime. Well, no, there are Berserk animes and the music <laughs> isn't nearly as good. Oh, okay. And it's not an opening either. Mm. So is it, have I made it? Am I done? <laughs> you can be. Sticks with you eventually. <laughs> Took only a couple months. Shut up. <laughs> you got a butterfly charm. Yeah, that's. Uh, I bet. What? You got a little butterfly necklace. Okay. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Actually, I was interested to see where else it would go. But F me, I guess. What else is down there? I legitimately do not remember. Go again! <laughs> no. For the sake of the LP, we're not doing it. <laughs> somebody, thank you. Just, just somebody. Come on. Could, do you mind looking that up? Because I'm curious. I don't have that. I can look it up. Oh, that's true. Do you mind looking Yeah, up? I got it. Savage, wait, hang on. What's Savage Garden? That's a band, right? Yes, it is. Okay. 
There's a very specific reason I know that. Okay. This one is the Savage Labyrinth. Right. Okay. The, the floors. Scroll. So why do you know that? You'll find out. One. Soon. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. There's not. There's like. You. There's some cool bonus stuff, but it's not like. Not. Not. Is it like a heart container? I'm, I'm still not going to do it, but, like, out of curiosity. Uh, it's a piece of heart and a, another thing. Another It's called the Hero's Charm. You, like, can see your enemy's health meter. Oh, that's neat! <laughs> okay, okay. So, I'm on Zeldapedia, um, and it lists, like, what happens by floor. Mm -hmm. And it said, floor 31, which is where you just were. Mm -hmm. Recovery floor. Triper's chart. Triforce Shard. And I was like, what? No. But it's an HD version where they don't make you get oh, the shards not even and a shard the shards. Thing. Okay. You just go right to the shards. So, we're good. Everything is fine. Alright, well, we're gonna investigate this island because it's not on our map yet, and I'm curious. Mm -hmm. Would you like to change, to change the look? Like change the wind to be more. Wait. We're gonna go check out this <laughs> island. It's not on our it's map not yet. Map yet. I gotta decide what order these pictures go in. Wow, life is such a struggle. <sighs> Okay. I'm good. <laughs> Got some water. Oh, frogs over there. I hope they have bait. I keep forgetting what's up. I've got three bait. Perfect. The next item on our talking points is also you. It just says Spectre. As in the James Bond film, I think. <laughs> I don't know exactly where I wanted to go with that. <laughs> Probably trashing it? Man, Spectre's a bad movie. It's been a very long time, and by that I mean however long since it came out. So here's the thing. Quantum of Solace was boring. That was its biggest sin. Uh-huh. If a stupid thing happened while Daniel Craig was James Bond, it probably happened in Spectre. If you have any memories of a <laughs> dumb James Bond thing happening with Daniel Craig. I remember some BS involving a mountain and like multiple vehicles crashing down a, a mountain. You got that right. On the island due east of here lives an old man who was once a master swordsman and he has a knight's crest. Okay, I guess that's worth looking into. Wait, isn't that the old guy you're aspiring against? Mm hmm? Oh wait, that is the island due east of here. Is that worth talking to him about? Um, open up your inventory. Go up to the spoil- yeah, see? Check, take a look inside there. Got a lot of- got, got some yes. stuff in here. Yes, it is. You have many- actually, I think you have- Oh, it's regrets. just- that's it. Yeah. I, I've seen that on his thing, shelves. Yeah. So, probably not worth it. Because I assume he'll just give me another one. Unless I give him more. Uh, is it worth it? It is worth it. <laughs> okay. I believe you have enough. Um, oh my god, yes, this. Okay. I don't know, just this island is weird and fun. Alright. Um, there's a point where, oh, that's a big boy. It's, okay. You don't Hello, realize friend. how big those boys are until they're up close. Yeah. Well, I think you can boomerang him if you are distracted. I'm not. I'm, I'm having a great time. Mm -hmm. Is 
is golf. It is golf. This is golf. Okay. Yay! Oh! That guy okay. came for me for ah! outside. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> God. And he's dead. Uh, well. Well, he's di he's disabled. As in, like, cannot. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, dang it! Too close. Um. Yeah, there's a point where James Bond is told stop drinking so much, and so he orders like a healthy drink. What? Like that a doesn't seem right. like a health drink. That seems wrong. And then he gets the drink, and he's like, this is stupid, and like, makes fun of the bartender for giving him the drink he ordered. <laughs> Here you are, sir. One prolytic digestive enzyme shake. Do me a favor, will you? Throw that down the toilet. Cut out the middle, man. Interesting, interesting. Perfectly in character for James Bond. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> Fair. And you know how there's M and Q, right? M, M runs MI6, and then Q gives them all the gadgets. Mm -hmm. So they introduce Andrew Scott, who's Moriarty from Sherlock. I know. Oh, yes. Yeah. And I never trusted him because he's Moriarty from Sherlock. Exactly. And then he turns out to be a huge traitor, and everyone's like, what? Wow. Could never have guessed it. Um, and then, um, but anyways, when he gets introduced, they're like, okay, so James Bond is like, all right, so he's M and he's Q. I guess we can call you C. What? <laughs> there is no explanation what? given for what he means by that. Congratulations on your new appointment. Thank you. I suppose we should call you C now. No, no, Max, please. No, I think I'll call you C. C. As you wish. Well, my door is always open, 007, for my employees. This merger is going to be a whole new chapter for us. We're going to bring British intelligence out of the dark ages into the light. That's <laughs> <laughs> just picking letters in the alphabet now. And then later on, when it turns out that C is a traitor, uh, they're like, he's like about to kill M, and, and he's like, guess we find out what M stands for, and I forget what M stands for in his book. <laughs> But then it's far too many jokes. And then, Mediocre. And then something like that. And then M goes, Well, I guess we also found out what C stands for. And he reveals that the gun C has has no bullets in it. And then M is like, careless. <laughs> and then I think How predictably moronic. But then isn't that what M stands for? Moron. And now we know what C stands for. Careless. I think he kicks him off of a building. <laughs> oh, that Ray Fiennes wow. as yeah. well. <laughs> yeah, in Skyfall, they introduced Ray Fiennes. It's like, all right, we're back to a really not cool, refined M. Judy Dench was fantastic, oh, but like, um, we're back to like kind of more old fashioned, very classical um, dude as M. Mm -hmm. And then he's just like, oh, yeah, you're careless. And then, kick, <laughs> then he kicks him off the building. Bad puns on a special easily. I don't think you're doing it right. I don't need this. <laughs> the peanut gallery has determined. <laughs> You're having problems. Yay! <laughs> yeah, we get it. Uh, what else happens, Inspector? Should I pull up a plot Lord. summary? Well, no. Here's the thing: is I looked up why is why is he called C? I looked, <laughs> looked up, up why. I looked up Spectre why, <laughs> and the second thing was the other biggest question I had, which is just why is there a net? Because inexplicably, when they go to the big tower, 
they just jump off of the tower and there's a net that catches them oh. that was just there. Cool. Like they had seen the net earlier, but there's no reason for the net to be there. Yeah. Huh. Oh. So yeah, just look up Spectre Y and see what other questions you get. Alright, Google, what have you got for me? Spectre Y. Why is C called C? There you go. Is Why? It... <laughs> Why didn't the drill work? Oh yeah, uh, yeah. I okay. It's been a while since I've seen it, but I'll get to that. But what else? <laughs> what other questions are there? Why was there a net? Good. Why did Hinks kill? H i n x. I don't. Oh, that might be Dave Bautista. I don't. Seen that movie? Oh yeah, he oh. totally was. Oh, oh, I remembered my the extra dumb thing. <laughs> but it's not even. It's not even the drill. Okay, does that guy, is that useful at all? Oh, no. What is this hole for? I don't know. Jump in it! But I want to get the treasure chest first. Which way is the wind blowing? Um, I don't think the right way. Yeah, the wrong way. Uh, the last one's just YC. <laughs> <laughs> Spectre YC! Same. Um, so yeah, um... <laughs> Sorry, I just typed in Y did. Why did Spectre fail? <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, it was like, all right, Christoph Waltz our new, is our new bad guy. And everyone's like, is he playing Glowfeld? And they're like, no. Aww. And then he was playing Glowfeld. Um, who is also apparently James Bond's secret half-brother. Was that a thing? Yeah. Oh, boy. That. They were raised in the same house, apparently, but James just forgot. Wait. Because... Jeez, what happened in Sherlock too. Yeah. <laughs> and it was bad both times. Yeah, it was. Um, so yeah, anyways, Blofeld's like, I'm gonna I'm gonna shove this drill into your brain. Oh, I remember that. And you're part. not gonna forget everything that happens and you won't be able to function anymore. And he puts the drill in James's brain and like completes the operation. And then James Bond is like dazed for a couple of seconds, or like like a minute, a full minute maybe, and then he's just back to normal. Like the drill just flat out doesn't work the way it's supposed to. <laughs> the drill that went into his brain? Yeah. Cool. I'm gonna see what the plot summary has to say about that one. I wanna see their explanation on the Wikipedia. And then they run away from the base and shoot a few things, and luckily it does enough to blow up the base. Yep. I still haven't gotten to the dumbest part of Spectre. <laughs> so there's the part where he's making out with, I think it's Leah Sado, and they get drunk, and and they 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 bang, because it's James Bond. But anyways, he's still drunk. He goes into the next room, and is just sitting there on the chair, drunk. And then he sees a rat, like a, fool. Like a literal rat, mm -hmm. a rodent, yeah. literally pulls his gun on the rat. He shoots the rat. No, he doesn't shoot it. He pulls a gun on the rat and asks, who are you working for? <laughs> Who the rat is working for? You know what? It turns out the rat yes. seems to have been working for the bad guys because the rat enters this little, this little tunnel, and then James investigates it, and it turns out that the tunnel's part of a hidden wall that <laughs> oh. leads to a hidden room in the building where the bad guys were. Oh, that's so dumb! It's oh so God. dumb. That's amazing. Best movie ever. <laughs> Venom. Who? <laughs> uh. Oh my god. Uh, can I, do I sh what, can I show this guy my telescope? What happened? 
<laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello, friend. This, does this guy do anything? I don't think so. I think oh, it's just well. Like a ah! I'm down here now. I think it's just like a bit, because normally the like old man ho ho are just like looking at something important. Right. And you like follow their gaze. But yeah. This guy's just looking at his kaleidoscope. Yeah. Good joke, right? Yeah. Wish that I, lighted great. Wish I had written it. Okay, it's time to come up with a caption. Red, where are you? <laughs> Red! Red! <laughs> you must return the piece of the thing. <laughs> ah, it's dying! <laughs> Alright, what? Oh, wait, first I gotta open my charts. Middle of the battle, Link pulls out his map. <laughs> yeah, he just give me a second. <laughs> just right around here. Gosh darn it! March twenty. That's when I was there. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right, should I go north and keep exploring, or should I go straight back to Ouch. Big Boy Island? Um, you can teleport back to Outset at any time. That's true. So I'll, so, I'll explore a little yeah, bit. If you wanna. Wait, 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 wait. Before we go anywhere. Um, no, nope, <laughs> don't worry about that. Everyone's like, Link? Dang it, never mind. I thought, I, I thought there was treasure here, mm. but it was lies. <laughs> yeah, I deserve that one. <laughs> All right, Red, let's get the F out of here. What's that? What? That. What? what? Thing right in front of you. The island? Yeah. That's where I'm, I don't know, that's where I'm going. <laughs> Sounds good. Don't, don't know what you want from me. <laughs> Answers. Now, I need the treasure. Treasure. <laughs> treasure lies with Charlotte. <laughs> the secret, secret, secret lies, lies with, with Charlotte. Charlotte. I apologize. Cool. Hello, hamster. This is taking a while. Okay, here it is. It's deep under the depths of the ocean. What? Okay. Now I can pay off my debt. Yep. <laughs> Don't have to steal from your grandmother anymore. <laughs> Just so familiar. Be careful. The weather's so familiar. Yeah. Is that okay to see? Yes. <laughs> we actually live in London. Yeah. <laughs> I see Frogo. Time for Frogo to give is info. Is it a frog or a fish? Oh, yeah, it is a fish. fish in Phantom man. Hourglass, it's a frog. That's why I said that. Mm. Oh, yeah. The golden frogs. Hoy! Hoy, hoy! That'd be nice. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. I love how the fish just kind of attacks it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Slaps into you and then swims away. Here you go. 
it. It. The clown. Oh, a wee bit of the right half of the moon is this missing. This is actually. That seems incredibly useful. Yeah. I forgot where this was, so I'm glad you accidentally found it. I did not accidentally find yes. it. I'm exploring for a reason. I'm glad you explored good. It's, it is it is coincidental that I found the specific <laughs> one that's super helpful. But the whole point of exploring is to find helpful stuff. Fair, fair. We're glad you coincidentally found it. <laughs> On your bumbling adventure. No, bumbling. Bumbling. <laughs> bumbling. <laughs> Dang it. I knew it wasn't gonna work. I needed to check. Got it. Giraffe, how did you get all that stuff here? From Hamster's car, I would imagine. Uh, but yeah. I could be wrong. Uh, well, I'm a liar. Beardy McTrader face? A redheaded friend? No. Ah, Maggie. Maggie. The perfect disguise. Maggie. Maggie. Like, like the Meg. You were there when we came up with this. <laughs> I was. I know, because I've been re-watching the Dead Space 3 videos. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a long time. Is this a thing, or is this... I think the hole behind it. I know, but I that's why I wanted to check this first. Checked it. <laughs> <laughs> We really are the peanut gallery, good lord. <laughs> I've always been a peanut gallery. <laughs> this is neat. This looks like that uh, Super Mario 64 level. It kind of looks like Moana. That too. It does. Oh, Moana <laughs> gets all the love, but <laughs> Super Mario 64, who okay, cares? Okay, it's a great game, but Never Moana makes me weep. He's here. Just, just jump into that bat. <laughs> And Link's high now. <laughs> I was gonna Doom. say. Oh yeah. <laughs> Please tell me his eyes are red now. <laughs> That'd be a bold choice. Ah. <laughs> Excuse. So this is a little mini dungeon? I can't imagine this would be an all-out dungeon. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> That's just weird. That too. Whoa! <laughs> Got her. I love Dead Space 3. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this does seem like progress. I nearly. What are the. What are the bad guys called in Dead Space? Necromorphs. Necromorphs. For some reason, I nearly said replicants. Which is. No. <laughs> yeah. We have a lot of strange songs. Yeah, spooky sounds. Oh, he's back. Ah! <laughs> oh, wait, do I have to, to get him to... You. Or do I have to make him grab this pot? Because uh, he likes grabbing pots, apparently. No. Well, we went with your idea. I hope you're happy. <laughs> Didn't work. <laughs> Not wrong. <laughs> you should have reacted faster. <laughs> oh dang it! I'm an idiot. I got it. I mean, I don't got have it like a hundred percent, but I these are torches. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Can I burn? I can burn them. Yeah. Burn it. 
set fire to it all. Burn it all. Burn it all. Did we go for three separate references there? No, I was also my really good Michael B. Jordan impression. Yeah, that British <laughs> accent that Michael B. Jordan has in Black Panther. <laughs> I, I was just doing touchback. That works too. I dig it. Do we want to talk about the Disney song bracket? It's so painful. <laughs> but yes. I, I, I don't know where to start, though. <laughs> I'm assuming... Have you guys moved on since the... No. Um, no I'm too scared. Got it. Like, at this point, I've determined just because it will start a bigger fight if I don't do this, I'm going to give it to Hawaiian Roller Coaster Ride. Mm-hmm. Because I don't want to start nothing. Technically, I don't. I don't know anymore. Galactic Hero is ruining everything. Is the is the? <laughs> Wait, what did he do? Here? Because he's trying to gimmick the tiebreakers, not because he actually wants to use his tiebreaker on Coco, just to prove a point that the tiebreakers can be abused. Yeah. He's using. He's trying to use his tiebreaker thing. Wrong way. And if he just shut up, the match would be over. But just to like, just to show me <laughs> that it could go wrong, he chose to make it go wrong. This guy's guarding this one, so I'm gonna do this one. Wow. He like he tried to do a good deed later. By but it was a cheap yeah. good deed. And I, I think it was misinterpreted when he swapped over to Hawaiian Roller Coaster. It, the, the great fight is between Hawaiian Roller Coaster Ride from Lilo and Stitch and Remember Me from Coco. And I did not, like, I didn't watch Lilo and Stitch as a kid. So Neither I, did I. I do That's not my this, main issue, yeah. Yeah, I don't have this very deep, like, visceral reaction that so many people are feeling. I don't have it either. <laughs> you, you do really like it, though. I like it, but it's not like I have a visceral reaction to the movie. That's true. It just gives me nostalgia for a home. Right. Fair. Um. I should be paying attention to which ones don't work, right? <laughs> yeah. Probably. That one doesn't work. <laughs> Perfect. Um. Will you remember that next time? Do you remember which one it was? <laughs> well, if maybe you stop spinning around so often. I'm not the one choosing to spin. <laughs> Anyways, that yeah, Where's the map? That brought us to a 5-5 five, five vote, and I installed a tiebreaker system where everyone gets one single tiebreaker. We're going to go for the far corner. Does that sound good? Okay. If it's wrong, I'll remind you. But then people started trying to... Dang it. Yep. Don't do the far corner. People started stacking tiebreaker votes, which I kind of wanted to avoid. But people are very passionate about both of these songs, so I don't, I didn't want to like dis allow that either. Mm. And it got to the point where it seemed like two people on each side were willing to use my tiebreaker and do the D tiebreaker, and I was like, oh what, man, I'm losing track already. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> the, this is what the bracket does. This is, it destroys you bit by bit. <laughs> it does. Um, now you understand. <laughs> I've always understood. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. Um, but And since I was running the bracket and people, particularly Gary is her code name, <laughs> were like, these are both really good songs. Can we just figure out a way to move on? And I was like, fine. I wouldn't normally do this for this matchup, but I'll use my tiebreaker just so we can move on. Mm -hmm. And then lo and behold, Hamster also decided to use her tiebreaker. She was partially coerced into it. Yeah, like, that's another thing. Giggles? What is her name? Anne. Anne. Perfect. Um, Giggles is a good one too. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I think there's only one option left, that's right? The corner, yeah. That's but the not the far corner. No, we know that. Not the ant one. This one. Um, yeah. But anyways, she used it. And then I was like, okay, well then I retract mine because the only reason I used it was because to move it on. I was trying to move it on. And also, and also because I don't want 
half of us use our tiebreaker in one match because I think that's stupid. <laughs> I was like, if anyone else wants to negotiate down, I think that'd be a good idea. To which Galactic Hero says, well, that's stupid. So I'm going to ruin wait, wait, wait. everything. Wait, wait, wait. Don't light them all on fire. You got that right. <laughs> What would you do without me? Nothing. <laughs> well, it was the wrong one. So. <laughs> and now we know. So yeah, Galactic Heroes like, well, I, I read. Well, okay. At that point, I think you also retracted your tiebreaker for Remember Me because you did. were like, no point in wasting it. Which is b b my philosophy is why are we wasting all of it if the people using their tiebreakers aren't going to break the tie for in their favor? That's and so. Right Yes, yes it is, yes it is. And then, and that's when Galactic Hero steps in and it's like, well, I'll use my typebreaker because if I can just take it back at any time, then I'll just do that. Just trying to prove a point, but making things far, far worse. Um, for everyone. And, um... It caused a schism and people died. People did die. People left the group chat, which is basically that's, dying. That's it. When you die in the group chat, you, you die, die for real. real life. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I don't oh. think that should have worked the way it did, but it did. Um. Oh god, I was gonna say something. Oh, it's always Coco. It's it always, is always Coco. Coco. This is good. Ooh. Um. But we did, uh, most of the same people who are doing this bracket, we were at Disney World, and we did a bracket to decide what the best Disney and Disney Pixar, they were all kind of lumped together. Movie uh, overall. Movie overall was, yes. Oh, that's more confusing than I thought it would be. Um, <laughs> okay. So this is telling me... At what point... So it, it still always has to be at night. Yeah, when yes. the moon is at a certain cycle where it will be. Okay, so I, so it is worth it to go around and map all the islands because, who knows which of these <laughs> islands it'll be on. Or shape. Well, it'll be on that island when it is that moon. I know, but I don't have to wait several days. Or you could use your spell that turns day into mm, night. No. <laughs> There's no time. I also don't. Wait, no, diamond. We're at the diamond part right now. Okay, yeah, we can just do that because we're already at the diamond thing. Gee, I wonder. You're right. You're right. You're right. I'm not saying you're not right. Uh. I wonder. <laughs> oh, we you were... can make it. Oh! Yeah! Okay, now be very careful. Thank 